Okay, so what is up everyone? This is Ken here. Welcome back to Tech Karen YouTube channel Statics OS. Most of you guys already heard about this OS, which is based on the Pixel OS and comes with only a bit of extra features, not come with any kind of huge customizations, but main focus is on performance and battery backup. But I've noticed after installing it on my Redmi Note 10 Pro is the performance is just awesome in the terms of battery backup unfortunately it's not one of the great ones out there but in the terms of performance it's great we're going to talk about the static OS and it's available for many devices and link for all of the supported devices is in the des description as always and this one is static OS the thing is this one is the launcher launcher which we have installed but this is not the default launcher also things might be different in your devices also but most of the things remain same like static OS features and basic things as you get in static OS official version but this one is launcher launcher which i'm using here which is not the default one in my case but maybe in your case too the thing is i'm using the magic module for this and what is the magic module which i'm using right now let me just show you by going on here a lot of magic modules by the way i'm using on this device on this custom room and if you want to check out the, a lot of modules on magic magic modules a lot of videos are already available on my channel so make sure to check out that the launcher which i'm using right now as you just saw the launcher which is called a system less launcher the magic module and if you don't know you can also install the magic module of system less launcher on your device running android version 11 almost all custom rooms support it for that so if you are using any other custom room and want to install the launcher launcher you can and it's not a bad choice along with it i'm using some other magic modules also which we're not going to talk about in this video so let's just forget forget about this moving on to the main thing about static so yes this is not the default UI by the way also as you just saw in the magic that i also have applied the substratum theme and the best part is substratum themes working perfectly fine there might be some issues there but most of the things are working perfectly fine here quick settings has many extra tiles available for you which you can go and enable or disable whatever you want to do everything is just up to you a lot of extra tiles are available and the thing is you cannot customize extra things the recording option is also available for you you cannot customize the rows and columns unfortunately but it's not the big thing as it is based on pixel so 2 by 3 is a by default ui it's not bad the best thing is safety status should pass and you will be able to use banking apps on your device in my redmi note 10 pro i have not faced any kind of issues while ba using banking apps google pay paytm etc all the banking apps were working just perfectly fine the thing is if you use magic on a device or yes basically if you root your device you definitely need to hide the magic from settings if you don't hide it safety status will be broken and you will not be able to use banking apps but if you haven't rooted your device if you don't want to root if you don't want to use magic on device safety net status should definitely pass out of the box for all of the devices all the devices should support this most of the devices are coming with the google camera go edition pre-installed static OS comes with the google camera go edition for the redmi note 10 pro and maybe for other devices also the google camera go might be pre-installed which is not a bad choice it is actually quite good maybe in your device you get the miui camera if you're using a xiaomi device but it's not sure but google camera go edition is not bad and if you're getting google camera go edition pre-installed which means good camera quality by default you also have the google cam support by the way let's move on to settings and let's check out some features which you get here for example notification history the very good android version 11 feature in the terms of battery backup as you previously just mentioned you earlier that battery backup is not up to the mark but it comes with some customizations for you for example the battery indicator which you can customize battery usage as you can see some huge drainage there i was using this build from approximately three to four days now but yes the performance is just one of the great ones out there but in the terms of battery backup it's not that great we might consider some other custom rooms for that I, i'll share with you very soon about redmi note 10 pro and terms in the terms of extra customizations as you can see you can customize the styles and wallpapers where you have some extra interesting fonts options available for you i haven't applied any fonts from here i have applied a custom fonts from magisk and you can also do that this will not apply systemlessly you get some pre-installed good good amount of wallpapers you have this option with backdrop wallpapers and this on device wallpapers and yes on device wallpapers which means you don't require any kind of internet connection for that looks quite good here 
launcher has some issues while applying these wallpapers so it's just my advice specific thing it's not about your business everything else i have already shown you till now everything else i have already shown you as i previously mentioned to you and direct sound enhancer is also available in the redmi note 10 pro device something is interesting these were things i just wanted to let you know static source is quite good in the terms of performance if you're looking for performance based custom room install this right now on redmi note 10 pro and other devices links also in the description this is all thanks for watching don't forget to like and share this video if you're new here don't forget to subscribe me goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the edge